Hello everybody, it is I, the Luigi Big Mac, and welcome back to Wario World. Last time, we beat the uh, Green Greenhorn Forest. Uh, very, very handily too. Not, not really a whole lot of problems there. Next up is Green, Green Hood Ruins. I think that's what it's called. Uh, doesn't tell us. Doesn't say right there. Anyway, let's just head in. And like I said, best song in the game. All right, so first thing first, we're gonna jump on here, push that, punch you, dude, and we got ourselves porcelain, porcelain urn, or is, or is that porcelain? Yeah, whatever. However you however you pronounce it, that's uh, that's what that is. I hate I hate these boxes. There we go. Uh, I'm pretty sure this fine China. Yep, fine China. Knew it. So, fun fact. The song playing in this level re uh, returned in Wario Land Shake It. Uh, albeit remixed, but still, it returned. So, even even the dev that Nintendo knows how, how good this song is. Anyway. If you're surrounded by monsters, pull out a mad move and knock them out with one blow. When you're holding a monster up in the air, rotate the control stick to do a wild swing ding. If you jump and press the R button while holding your foe, you'll do a pile driver. It's earth shaking. So that's that. Yep. So let's just grab this, this, this guy right here, and let's give him hell. There we go. Really? You already? Huh? All right then. The wild swing ding is a spinning move. He spin. And the pile driver is a ground pound move. Master the finer points of these two mad moves to turn gears, break down iron doors, de and deal with tricky traps. Use your head, Wario. I could use my head, or I can, or I can do uh, some other stuff. So technically, you're supposed to to use the uh, wild swing ding to open that up. However, however. Like, I'm pretty sure there's a way, if you jump at the right spot, you might be able to, uh, grab on the ledge there. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Let me, let me give it one more, let me give it uh, a few more, a few more goes. Those guys... I know there's a speedrunning technique where you can do like a super jump. I, I don't know how to properly do it. I won't be. My uh, my shoulder my shoulder fast and that pop out. All right then. All right, one more try. All right. Do what? All right. I guess I guess I guess we'll do it the proper way then. You know, fun game. Oh, actually, hold up. I just remembered. Whoop. Oh, nope. It is possible to, uh. Laugh. Boop. Ah. Uh, pick it up. Well, that's the first. All right, let's let's give that another go. Okay, I think actually, I, what I can do is just open that a bit and just slide through. Yeah, there we go. We did it. Yeah, I think in my old let's play, I think I was able to just kind of jump uh, jump out there and like. Kind of do like one of one of like one of those type of, type of things. So these things, these things are indestructible. Or that's what the game wants you to think. If you use a mad move, if you use a mad move on it, I 
You can actually deal, da deal damage to it. There we go. I, I I killed it. There we go. Yeah. So so if you want so if you want some extra coins, it's definitely a good idea to go after these guys. However, we have a new set of sub area. These doors. Well, first let me. These doors will not open. Uh, with a with any old regular ground pound. Oh oh wow, you're back again. Cool. Anyway, uh, I'm stealing you for a bit. You need to do a pile driver to get through those doors. Now these sub areas are supposed to be. You can actually punch that arrow and collide with it, but yeah. Yeah, these sub areas are supposed to be a lot more challenging. Now, right now, it's a bit. Huh, really thought I could make that. Ah, yeah, well. Okay. There we go. Yeah, so these are made. These are supposed to be uh, challenging for a reason. So, this first one's obviously made a bit easier. Also, you cannot suck up stationary coins. Ooh, almost fell off there. Yeah, I don't, yeah I'm not going to collect every single coin. I'll, I'll be a moron to try and do that. Because you use coins up a lot anyway, so it's not really a big deal. But yeah, everything else, yeah, I'll definitely be collecting. All right, what do you have to say, pal? Using the glue globes on the wall up ahead, you can jump and stick through the walls. When you use, when you see these sticky orbs, try some some of your moves. When when jumping to a glue globe, check your footing, mark mark your goal, and then jump. It takes practice, so don't get frustrated, okay? All right then. All right, we have another sub area over here, a normal one, so it shouldn't be that bad. Shouldn't be that bad, I say. So here's the thing, it honestly, it honestly isn't that bad. Well, I still got hit anyway, because I'm a moron. Got greedy, went for the chest. And I got, and I got punished for it. Simple as that. Oh, hey, guys here. Yeah, it's only, if you're, if you're only making me pay 20 bucks, I'll totally go for it. So satisfying. And there's a hole there, of course. I knew, I knew it wasn't that easy. I knew, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. And yet, and yet, here I am falling. Oh, and you're, and you're back. And I missed again. God damn it. All right, maybe for that third one, I don't do the uh, the dash attack. Also, also the uh, the shoulder bash is your fastest way of movement. All right, this one, I'll punch each single one of them in individually. All right, there's a green button somewhere. Where, where am I missing? Oh, and these right here. You walk into anything that looks like this, it could be one of two things. Either arena or a mini boss. So they ignore the damage this thing. You can't really damage it, so you have to use their minions against them. That sucks. Yeah, they can shoot lasers, they can do some funny things. Depends on the color. But this one I think only just shoots lasers. Up oh, there you go. And there you go. Ah! Well, first thing first. Punch him down so we get easier access. Especially when we need the green button. Wah, wah. Alright then. 
Oh, hold on, I'm going the wrong way. I'm a moron. There we go. You know, I did check what we got for that one. So, ceramic vase, teapot. So, it looks like a lot of breakable, uh, so it seems like a lot of great, uh, breakable, uh, what do you call it? Uh, like, you know, fine china. Like, expensive, expensive items that... I don't know how that happened, but okay. Play. And ready then, uh... He brings you back down there, so that's a bit um, a bit unfortunate. But what am I gonna do about it? Anyway, I meant to jump down here. Oh, there's nothing there already right, then. All right, that's oh, wow. That's our that's our second gold piece. Hopefully, we can find the other soon. All right, let's see. You can't get over there uh, by normal. Well, I, well, I was about to say by no means, but that that just ain't true. All right, well, first thing first. Uh, fuck that. Go behind here. Go to the sub area. All right, this one. There we go, now I'm able to jump through. And just like that. Pretty simple enough. Alright, we can just ignore him. Well, I, I think the guy's up there. Oops, oops, oops. Oh, I was almost able to get through. Man. Stun them. There we go. Yeah! Alright, well, let's, let's head back down there again. And then let's uh, head down here. Okay, admit, let's try. Let's try with the smaller, with the smaller guy. There we go. All right, you guys get out of here. All right then. Well, first thing first. Be an idiot not to do that. Someone around here, there might There we go. Precious spot! You know, it, might, you know, it might be easier if I just... Rather than doing that, just take the long way. There we go. Then we just hop up here. Got another sub area to go to. Here we go then. We have these funny blocks now. All right, now one thing, one funny thing with the with the uh, with these blocks here, you can just do some funny things like. Well, I think you need another block. Yeah, you need another block. That do the funny thing, but... If you have another one of those uh, force blocks, 
just if you just ground pound on them, you can just go flying up and go out and go so high that the game counts you as out of bounds and has to respawn you. Whew. Anyway, there's a battle ring up ahead. One minute battles begin when you enter the battle rings. Fight everything that enters the ring. The number of coins you get depends on the number of monsters you defeat. So fight hard. So yeah, so this is how you can make a lot of money. So just uh, grab these soon. Yes, Wild Swing Ding is definitely something you want to, you want to definitely do. And here's the thing, when you visit level again, you don't have to do the Power of Rings or Mini Bosses again. I probably should have mentioned that. That is quite the that is quite the change there. Man. Made a lot of moolah. Alright, oh, we got another one of those challenges. Oh, luckily there's a luckily there's a guy here. Alright, so this one also this one also isn't that bad. It's just a lot of patience, and also avoiding those spikes. Those are the other thing. And just like that. Let's see, how many pieces we need? Uh, three more. Uh, it, mainly his head and his other foot. Alright then. Well, first thing first, we have to punch it. We have to punch that guy. Ow. Anything else over here? Aha! Well, first thing first. Be a, be a moron not to do that. So, in later levels, some of these enemies will take multiple hits and knock down. You know, difficulty spikes and all that. Or as, or as the, uh, the cloaker likes to, or, or as the, uh, Payday 2 cloaker likes to call it, a difficulty tweak. Anyway, that's that. So anyway, this is, uh... Now we're at a challenging point. So, of course, I'm gonna have to get to the end of this. We're almost there. Woo! There we go. Only missed once. Yeah, so, like I said, these things will get challenging. But it's not a big deal. There we go. Gotta make sure I don't accidentally fall. Let's see, this guy we can just ignore. He's too slow. He's a turtle. Turtles are slow. Alright, so this one's actually very easy to figure out. This one you have to go off the particles. And the other one is... There it is. Off the sound. Yep, and that, that guy will be right there, so rather than jumping out, you just kind of walk out. Alright, lucky figure. Wait a minute. I feel like I'm missing something. I won't have to redo that uh, ladder thing again, but that's fine by me. It appears I'm missing... Uh... It appears I'm missing a... Uh... 
an item somewhere. But where? Ooh, almost fell down. Where could this item be? And I got, and I got shoved off. Oh well. Hello, hello, you're the thorn. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just gonna, just gonna speed run this here. Hey, bad you thorns. Are you like that? I'll start playing me now if you're gonna start. Wow, there are no boxes. No, really. I have a bomb. You don't want. You don't want to touch me when I have the bomb. Uh -oh. Yeah. Well, oh wow! I just fade through that wall. Huh? Come here. Yeah. So, where is that cyan treasure at? Oh, there it is. Oh, that solves that issue. There we go. There we go. There we go. Had to backtrack for that one. Phase. Wow, just regular phase. Really, we backtrack just for regular old phase. Eh, whatever. Yeah. Also, these small guys. In these levels, they don't attack, but in the later levels, they will actually start attacking you, so also keep that in mind if you ever touch this game. So let's see, we're only missing one more, and the last one is definitely a, uh, because, like, you can tell the thing for this one is just, like, breakable stuff, and then, and then the last, uh, might as well. Uh, first thing first. Many more of my friends are being held against their will up ahead. If you see any of them, I really appreciate it if you save them. You'll be rewarded for coming to their aid, of course, Wario. We know how you like rewards. So, um... Okay. Off you go, Wario. Yep, we get, so we got all the sprintlings. Uh, I need one of you guys. There we go. Last, last gold piece. And the last, uh, uh, gem piece is also there. So, yeah. This one's a very easy one. Ah! Almost fell off there. Now there's... Now there's one more... Now we just have to find a button for that, so... That makes me wonder... Where is it? Okay, let's see, it's not there. Maybe think it's not behind there. Perhaps it's somewhere over there, it has to be. Okay, nope, not over there. Maybe he's underneath this guy? No, huh? Alright, well, let's look around here, maybe. It's been a good while since I played this game, so I'm not gonna remember every tiny little detail. Uh, 
There it is. It was hiding. There we go. Now we can fight the boss now. What? Yep. Yeah, you don't need to climb that the first ladder. You can just up there. Boop. And would you look at that? It's a bloody NES. I don't know why this was thrown in there, but I will say this much. The second level of each world will have some sort of Nintendo console. So, this one is the NES. Hmm, I wonder what, what the next one would be. This, this guy is also a funny guy. He screams a lot. Haha, he can't get me here. Just gonna go over there. Yep, and then when he starts doing that, he's just gonna chill over here. Laugh at him. Then one more, then he'll spit out more of these things uh, faster and farther. Don't worry about them. And just like that, he's beaten. Yeah, laughing at Mario. And we did it. Second level completed. Woo! There we go. That's a lot of points. And coins. Alrighty then. Alright. Beautiful. So we now have five hearts. This is glorious. Alrighty then. That took significantly a tad bit longer. And these levels are only going to get longer and longer. Well, with that being said, that is the, uh, well, that is it for today's episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys enjoy the content that I do on this lovely channel, please consider subscribing. Hoping to see if we can, if we can try and hit 100 subscribers, because again, this Let's Play was being made around when I have like 40-something subscribers, so, hey, if it happens, it happens, so hooray. Ugh, excuse me. And, uh, yeah, until then, I'll see you guys in the next episode where we're going to fight, uh, Dino Mighty. Until then, uh, uh, until then, have a nice day, uh, night, afternoon, whatever time of day it is where you're watching this. And I'll see you on the flip side. Bye-bye.